In first problem, they said that use Euclid division algorithm to find HCF of 135 and 225. So let's take what are the numbers given 135 and 225. And Euclid's division algorithm is Euclid's division algorithm is A is equals to BQ plus R. 0 is less than or equals to R is less than B. Here A is dividend, B is divisor, Q is quotient plus R is remainder. The next this remainder should be greater than or equal to 0 and it should be less than divisor. The next the number which is bigger we have to take in place of A 225 is equals to what is B? B is 135. Then next we have to check in when we multiply 135 with some numbers we should get the nearest number or equal to 225. So where, where we are getting? So let's check that. If we multiply 13 with 2 we get 26 means it is more than 26 to 260. So we cannot take with 2. So let's go with 1. So 135 1 is 135. So if you subtract 225 minus 135, we will get 5 minus 5, 0, 12 minus 3, 9. So the remainder is 90. Since here remainder is remainder is not equals to 0, this proce procedure we have to continue. Next, this number comes here in place of A. 135 is equals to next 90 comes in place of 135. Then next in 90 table we have to see where, where we are getting the nearest number for 135. So if you see 9, 9 to the 80, 18. So 18 means it is increasing. So that's why we have to take with 1. 90 ones are 90. Now next sub, subtract 135 minus 90. 5 minus 0 5. 13 minus 9 is 4. So it is 45. So the remainder is 45. Next again this 90 comes in place of 135. So 90 is equals to 45 comes here. If you it is clear that if you multiply 45 with 2 we get 90 so let's directly multiply with 2 45 2 is a 90 90 minus 90 is 0 so the remainder is 0 the procedure here it stops therefore the hcf is 45 let us solve second bit that is 196 Given numbers are 196 and 38,220. So the number 38,220 is greater than 196. But we have to use Euclid's division algorithm. So let's write what is Euclid's division, division algorithm. Euclid's division Algorithm is A is equals to BQ plus R where R is less than or equals to 0, 0 is less than or equals to R and R is less than B that is divisor. Next we have to write the bigger number in place of A. So 38,220 is equals to 196 into Q. So in 90, 196 table we have to see where we are getting the nearest number to 38,220. Let us find this number. If you see 196, if you concentrate on these two numbers 19, in 19 table if we multiply this with 2 we get 38. But 
if you see it's not a three digit number so we have here five digit number to get this five digit number we should multiply this with another three digit number so what it will be if i am multiplying 196 with 200 i am getting 0 6 a 0 and 0 9 a 0 0 1 a 0 then next 0 6 a 0 0 9 a 0 0 1 a 0 then next 2 6 a 12 1 2 9 a 18 2 9 a 18 plus 1 19 1 2 1 a 2 plus 1 3 0 0 2 9 3 so if you observe we are having 38000 but we are getting 39200 so we ignore that but if you want the accurate answer so we can see that we are having zero at the end the number that another number is very near to 196 or 200 so let us check why because here zero is there so we will take 195 if we multiply any even number with 5 we get 0 so to get 0 we are multiplying this number 196 with 195 196 with 195 this 195 is near to 200 5 6 are 30 5 9 are 45 plus 3 48 5 1 are 5 plus 4 9 9 6 are 9 6 are 54 9 9 are 81 81 plus 5 86 9 1 are 9 9 plus 8 17 next 1 1 196 1 are 196 next 0 8 plus 4 12 1 6 plus 6 6 plus 6 12 and 9 plus 1 10 10 plus 12 is 22 9 10 11 18 so 3 8 to 38220 220 so here we are getting this number with 195 so 196 into 195 gives us 3 38220 so 38220 minus 38220 will give us the remainder 0 therefore the hcf is 196 therefore hcf is 196 in third bit they have given the numbers 867 and 255 let us solve this using euclid's division algorithm next what is euclid's division algorithm a is equals to bq plus r where 0 is less than or equals to r is less than b then next 867 is bigger among these two so we will write in place of a is equals to what is b b is 255 then next we have to see if you see it carefully it is 25 so in 25 table where do we get the nearest number to this so 25 fours are is 100 and we, we are getting 86 so let us see with 3 so 255 into 3 3 5s are 15 3 5s are 15 plus 1 16 3 2s are 6 plus 1 7 so it is better we should multiply this with 3 then next we have to subtract this 867 minus 765 7 minus 5 is 2 8 6 minus 6 is 0 8 minus 7 is 1 so the remainder is 102 then next 2 
655 comes in place of 867. Then next we have to continue this division with 102. Next, if you see this is 10. In 10 table, where do we get 25? So the nearest number to 25 is 10 to the 20. So let us multiply this with 2. So we will get 2 to the 4 and 2 0 the 0, 2 1 the 2. Next we have to sub subtract 204 from 255. So 255, 5 minus 4 is 1, 5 minus 0 is 51. So therefore the remainder is 51. As you see the remainder is not equals to 0, this procedure continues. The next we will write 102 here, next 51, 51, if you see 5 and this is 10. So in 5, in 5 table, where, we, where do we get 10, 5 to the 10. So we will multiply this with 2, 2 1 the 2, 2 5 the 10, that is 102. So 102 minus 102 is 0, so the, therefore the remainder is 0. As you see the remainder is 0, therefore our HCF is this divisor, 51.